I don't know why my camera looks like that, but <laughs> that's all right. Looks a little bit better. All right, guys. So I'm walking to the train. I'm about to do some postmates, like I told you guys before. So let's see how it works for me. Ta ta da! And I did my nails. Ta ta da! Um, I will, guys. I will keep you guys posted as I wait. I have the fleet app, I have the, the visa card with me, the prepaid, actually, yeah, I do. I have the prepaid visa card with me. Um, so let's see how it works for me. Some people get to do one, two deliveries a day um, as a walker. It depends, like, if they're, if they are, um, what time it is, or if they, or if they're near the hot zones, etc. You know, it depends on a lot of things. As I see on the internet, that's what it is. It depends on a lot of stuff. So I'll uh, keep you guys posted and we'll continue this vlog. <laughs> All right, you guys, so I just picked up my first delivery. Well, not just picked up, it was like five minutes ago, but I was also on the phone. You guys, here is the delivery, safe and sound in my bag, yes. Um. So, it's very important that if you guys are doing Postmates, you guys follow the hot spots, okay? And, like, it's it's important because I feel like most people that I've seen that have been walking, um, like, like um, walkers for Postmates, you guys have been, like, a little bit on the border of the hot spots. You have to be in the hot spot to be able to catch them as you go. So, I'm about to make my first delivery. I'll let you guys know how that worked out for me. Thank God for makeup, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So I just completed my first Postmates delivery. Ta -da -da -ta -ta. I'm about to go online again and see if I can pick up another order. I'm like walking back to the bus and see if I can take my ass back to 14th Street because I'm like down here um, and see and see what's up. See what I can pick up. But so far, so good. I made four dollars so far. Let's see. So guys, the whole time that I've been outside, I've charged my phone, um, ate lunch, I've only been able to do one, that one order. I think I'm going to stay out because I think what happens is at around this time of the day, you don't really pick up. I think it's it picks up again like during dinner time. So now it should be like picking up orders again. I saw a few people in the streets had like Grubhub and like DoorDash and stuff. Um, but I feel like for the most part, the orders are done like really, really early in the morning. I don't know why, but they're done really, really early in the morning. I'm going to stay out until about maybe 9, 9.30 um, because they do have another offer where you catch orders and they give you an extra $2 for, for the orders between 5.30 and 9.30 today. So we'll see. I haven't seen any other like Postmate people, like walkers in the street. I mean, you, I wouldn't be able to tell, but nobody else has the bag. So we'll see how that works out. I'm gonna walk to like 7th Ave. I've taken the bus just to like kill time and not like walk the whole city because that will kill my feet. So yeah, at the end of this video, I'll have like a few tip bits for you guys, or maybe I'll do something separate and like, like tell you guys like the do's and the don'ts and like, etc. So. We'll see. Hello, guys. So I'm back in my room. I'm cold. I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. Like, I worked, like, like I've been at work for, like, four or five hours. So maybe it's not that bad. <laughs> but first day at Postmates, I only did one delivery. I was outside from, like, fucking anywhere between 2.30 and 3 o'clock. I'm lying. Three o'clock until like maybe what time is it now? Um, let me see. I got home. I stopped at like nine. So that's that's a long time, right? I even went to church as I was walking. I went to get my um, what you call it? I went to get like artwork that I that I have in that I had ordered, and I had time for it all. Um, I had time for it all. Um, my review or whatever, my understanding of Postmates, am I discouraged? No. I'm going to go at it again tomorrow. I feel like we have to have, like, if you're going to do it, I'm a, I'm a Postmates walker. 
if you're gonna do it it can't be full time um and and expect for you to like start paying bills and, and stuff like that um like pay all your bills unless you're doing it like unless you're doing it on a car in a car or in a scooter or in a bike or whatever but if you're a walker it's probably not gonna get you a lot of money now it i realized that the peaks um you kind of have to like look at the peaks and there's certain days when things happen and certain shifts i think this is my plan for postmates i'm gonna do them every day for Saturday and Sunday, I'm gonna wake up very early and try to be out of my house by eight o'clock. So I have to, by, by yes, so by, cause most stores open at eight or nine. So people will start, you know, ordering stuff at around, at around that time. So I have to be out of my house by 7.30, 8 o'clock so that I can start picking up deliveries close to my house. So close to the Bronx, close, uh, you know, Washington Heights, Bronx area. So close around the vicinities. Um, that's what I'm going to do. After work, I usually leave work like 6, 7 o'clock. I, yes, I get paid for overtime, so that's a plus for me. Um, but I'm still going to go out there and try to get stuff because if sometimes I get home at like 10 or 11 and I do nothing, sometimes I'm just like walking around or like whatever, doing everything else that, that isn't going to pay me. Um, I might as well just start doing Postmates and just walk to like 14th Street or take the, tr the bus to 14th Street and and have the app on so that I can start getting deliveries. I think that's something that I'm going to start doing. I think it just depends on the peak hours. It it doesn't just depend on the hot the hot spots on the map. It's that's not how how I feel like it works. So another thing, I'll do like pros and cons videos maybe or a video of the pros and cons like in a week from now so that I can give you guys a total scoop of like an entire week because so this is just my first day and I think as a Saturday I, I messed up especially because it's Easter so I should have been out there earlier I should have been doing the deliveries from the morning until two or three o'clock in the afternoon as opposed to two three o'clock until like nine 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 thirty so tomorrow I'm gonna wake up rise and shine I still have to complete like other orders from like my other business but um my other YouTube channel and stuff like that. But I feel like it was good. Um, the first delivery was quick. It was easy. Um, again, I will tell you guys tips and, and pros and cons when I get the full scope and, 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 and stuff like that. Um, so I hope everyone enjoyed this video. Um, if you're thinking about becoming Postmates and doing Postmates, do it. Because money doesn't hurt anyone, especially if you're about to go on vacation. Hello. <laughs> so go ahead and do it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, the next vlog will probably be like different time zones or different times, like different clips of, you know, different times or different days. I don't know why I repeat myself so much. But different times and different days during this week. And then a separate video with the pros and cons of actually doing Postmates. So I will see you guys in the next video. Please like, share, and subscribe. And yeah. Bye. <laughs>